So, my name is Mars. Um, I'm working on this gigantic build behind me. It's a lot, but it's a lot of fun as well. So, I'm just going to be creative building and then messing around. So, yeah. I think the first thing, I guess I should give you a tour of what I have so far because I haven't really shown it off but I really really like it it looks really good with shaders so this is gonna be like a little village so I only have a couple houses so far but then this is the Athenium and it's still in work it's still a work in progress there's a lot I want to change uh, like this right here I don't really like how this looks it has to do with the lore of the story but I think the build that's completely done that I won't change very much if I even change it is this right here. I absolutely love it. It's the library or the archive I like to call it. It's so cool. I guess I can show you what it looks like in and I built this all in creative so it's not as hard as it would be if it was in survival, but I really like building, so yeah. Oh, I ran into a tree. <laughs> uh, let me turn on some shaders so you can see how it looks with those, because I think it's really cool. And now we let it load. Look at that. I just think it's so neat and like just the vibes are exactly what I wanted when I first started doing this like months ago like I could sit in here for hours and just stare at this I just really like it but that's not what we're working on today Today we're actually working on this build right here because there's a lot on this I need to work on because it's completely unfinished. Um, I like a lot of what I have, but the inside is lacking, I should say. Um, which is okay. It's just, there's a lot I have to do. Because um, I don't even have a flooring. <laughs> Which is alright, because what I have so far is stuff like this. I want more of this, like, florally, florally type. Would you say it's Mandela? I don't know if that's the right word, but it's like, it's gonna go outward and then curve over here and then come across here and then kind of swirl. I've even thought about doing, like, a second flower stemming right here. Um, Excuse me, so sorry. Um, so yeah, this is what I have so far. I just think it'll look really pretty once we get the rest of it done. I actually really do think- oh, I've had some Enderman friends. <laughs> That's great. Um, I think I do want to do like a second flower in the middle of this part here. I think that would look really, really cool. Okay. I think that's what I'm going to start with today. Oh, and if you want my palette, this is what I'm working with. I usually, uh, I have like a light center um, and it just goes to a darker like spruce. I think spruce is what this is. Yeah, so it like fades outward to give a really good like texture to the build. I'm also using green, I think it's terracotta. Yeah, green terracotta. So I think with this, I'm actually going to center it with... Because this is the center, right here. This lines up with the center of the, the build. And this pillar right here is the center block of the entire... This gigantic square right here. Um, this is just kind of added on so it doesn't really play into the measurements, but I think instead of centering it on this block, I might center it like right there. 
and then do the staircase because this is gonna be okay so since you don't know this is gonna be a staircase to this level here which I haven't worked on so you can get into this building or I might do a staircase here either way this staircase I think I'm gonna turn this lock right here the middle of the Okay, and just for reference, I need a... I should take a picture of what I have here. Okay. <laughs> now I have to pull it up. Let's see if I can find it. Okay. I'm just gonna keep that up for my sake. All right, and to building we go. Cause I think, I think repeating this first part of the flower over here would look really good and give a good, and if not, we can always take it down. So I think the first part of the, oof. Uh, okay. come out a little bit from the wall. I think it's actually two here. Ooh. I'm already forgetting everything I know about this build. <laughs> Oops. That's the one problem with doing like really big designs when it comes to building is I forget really easily what my original plan was or like the design. Cause this is really based off of the patterns. Like I think the patterns are one of the most important parts just solely because if you don't get the pattern right, it can look really wonky. Um, Okay, so then I did a diagonal path. I do remember this bit. Because I did three, and then... And then I did, like, I think I did spruce. Whoa! Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I think it was four. One, two, three, four. And I guess I can even go over here now, which is cool. Because before, that, that one over there doesn't have the back. That looks cool. I like that. Then I think I did on the sides. It'll look weird at first, but after we get most of it in, it's going to look a lot better. Ooh. Oops, <laughs> I put that the wrong way. Hmm. Okay, and then we did... I think it was this... What's the difference? I think I have more than one. Yep. Oh. Oh, it wasn't dark. I think it was spruce. Yeah. It was most definitely spruce. Maybe I'm wrong? I do not want to... No, I'm right. Oh, I was wrong. <laughs> Oops. 
Oh, so it goes a bit darker. Okay. I can see why I did that. All right. I'll keep it the way it is, and then... I'm surprised it's... Did I really use... I did. Huh. I... I totally thought I had used regular spruce here. Oh well, that's fine. That's just a part of fun of building, I guess. But... Honestly, can't remember what this side is like. Because I know there's stairs. I usually always put stairs. And then I think it's like this. Does that look right? It's honestly the length that I'm worried about. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, it was one short. That's okay. See, because this is only four. One, two, three, four. Yep. I need one more. That should be five. That looks a lot better. One, two, three, four, five. Oh wait, I think. Here we go. I did those backwards. So on this one, I faced it this way. So on this one, I need to face it this way to keep the same. Oops. Because then it keeps the same side going. And then on this one, I'll do This way, one going that way. Perfect. That looks neat. Oh, didn't mean to show that one. Perfect. That looks really cool. It's not done by any means, but we're getting there. I think the next part is adding in the green part to this first set of leaves. Wait, that's supposed to be... There we go. And then these are... I think that's right? That might be wrong though. There we go. That looks like the leaves that are over there. Yep. Except I think this one goes like that. And adds a little heart at the edge. There we go! Now it looks like the flowers. I think one of my favorite things to do when I'm doing big designs like this is add a lot of um, variety to how the like one section of color. So like on this part, because it's the same type of blocks, I can add like a green variety or even a different wood variety to give it a better depth. 
than what it had originally. And I think that's cool. So. And then I just did like an out layer of stone uh, to help. I guess I'm not I'm not done with that side. I don't know what I was doing there. <clears throat> Oops. Hmm. I can't remember. <coughs> My voice is dying. I'm so sorry. I think I did add a section here. Just like a small outline for the petals. Yeah, I did. I totally did. Look at that. Boom. That looks cool. I like adding the stairs as well. That gives a fun little depth too. And then this one... That looks good. I think that one has more diagonals than this one. See, because it has one, two, three, where this one only has two. That'll be interesting. Because then I'll have more of the straight leaves. Well, they're not... Yeah, anyway. Let's... I think another thing that I do when building, even though I don't need to, is keep a consistent pattern. Honestly, I don't know how to describe it. Despite loving building, it's sometimes really tricky to get the right um, vibe into a build without making it like repetitive. Um, so it's really nice when I don't have to worry about that as much. So like, let's say, oh, I need to come over here and count this section, four and then four, okay. So, like, when I'm building, like, in survival, so it's harder to, like, be able to tell what something's gonna look like without it. Because I do a lot of this, like, an overview, and you can't really do that in survival without, like, a ton of scaffolding which is a pain to get. And then if you accidentally like break the scaffolding, that's even worse. A lot of what I'm doing right now is just like copying what is already like created. Um, Cause I'm just repeating the patterns from that one over there. And then once I have it, oh, that lines up perfectly. That's cool. Okay. I will not complain about that. Is it only two? I think it is, but I just want to make sure. Yeah, we're right. And then 
the stairs to add depth. Okay. That like cuts off, but it's okay. I think I have another staircase here. And then here. Oh. There. One more side. This is taking me so long. I'm so excited to see what the final product's gonna look like, but I still have so much I wanna do. Because I also want to do in this little like ravine right here in this little room. I want to do like a basement thing with like giant bookcases like running floor to ceiling. So that's going to take me <laughs> a while as well. But if I get the outer stuff done first, I'll be happier because then I have more to prove that I've been working on this for like forever. It's, it's honestly been so long in the making. Not that I'm complaining. Because, like, if I didn't want to do this, I wouldn't. But the final project from, like, the first glance at what this might look like to building three giant buildings. Because, like, this one, this one took me forever to build. But this, this, like, section right here. Oh, here. I'll, I'll just show you because it's hard to explain. So if you come from the outside... into this area oops that was the wrong place to get dig in but it's fine so this area in here used to be like a giant mountain and then if you come i don't know if i'm going to be able to navigate this without getting never mind hold on okay in I should have just gone from up here. I don't know why I didn't do that. I made it hard for myself. So this used to be like a gigantic hill, right? So I had to like flatten it and then put all of this over it. It's, it was something, that's for sure. And so thinking about being able to get this done and like finally being able to see from clearing out an entire space, like a gigantic hill to a cool forest sur with surrounding a cool oh my gosh a cool build surrounded by a forest is just neat to me so i really want to get it done and in the grand scope of things i have a lot done um because like i think i want to say like maybe two months ago i didn't even have this section here and it hasn't taken me like i haven't worked on it like every single day but i've worked on it for quite a few so like really cool to finally see it coming together oh i think i did not do that one long enough what why does that look wrong it's not. I guess it just looks wrong. Hmm. Strange. Oh, maybe because it's... No, this one's... What? Hold on. Hold on. One, two, three, plus one. Okay, so this one's wrong. There we go. That looks better. That <laughs> looks a lot better. And then I already have that first section. I could, I could finish off this first here. Let me. Let me just.
Yeah, I can just taper in and then see where I want to do with that. That's looking cool. That's looking really cool. Okay. Next step. Is the outer section for this. Which is gonna be something. That's for sure. I want to get this first layer of the petal down before I work on any wait does it go out does it go out or in one two three four one two three right here it goes out that's strange I don't know why that's strange to me I think I may have done it wrong Maybe not? Oh, that's why. Okay. Because it comes back in right there, so it... Oh, okay. I see. I finally realized what I did the first time I built this. Maybe? Yeah, look at that. That looks the same. Okay, now time to repeat that one more time. Ooh. Three. I did this one wrong. That one's wrong. That one's most definitely wrong. There we go. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> I was going the wrong way. There we go. That's right. And then that should be... Oh. Uh-oh. What did I do? Is that five? Did I do five here? I did! No! One little mishap and all of a sudden, it doesn't like me anymore. Oh, just kidding. That was wrong. Wait. I have a set of three before this. Okay. Like, where did I go wrong? There we go. And then comes my favorite part, the gradients. Like a game of Tetris, but instead of already having pre-built blocks, you have to make the blocks. See? Because there's a, a, a T and then the Z thing. I like Tetris. Tetris is cool. I want to say it's like this. I'm looking at an image for reference just in case I manage to get this wrong. That seems about right. And then this, yeah, that's right. And then there's an oak heart in the middle. And then there's a spruce heart. And then there's another one of those. Wrong. Maybe? What? Oh, wait. No, it's oak here. And then the spruce is there. I see. I was like, what? Because it's in line with the heart. There we go. I was like, something's not quite adding up. And it's 
W. Did I use oak or spruce here? I think I used spruce. Nope, I used dark. Okay. Well, now I can't see. Okay. Coolio. There's the first one. Time for the second. Really? You're gonna sit in my way? Would you move? Thank you. Wait. Oh no. I've already forgotten the pattern. Oh, and then the spruce heart, then the oak heart. Then the two piece and the- yeah, there we go. boom okay and then it's the oak line and then the spruce line and then that one little dot thing and then the star voila there we go part of it is done whoa hello that's wild first off let's see if i like that i think i do a lot actually i think that's cool and then we do the four little things and then i have to make new designs <laughs> for the next so it's three. Okay. Not from that one. One, two, three. Right? From that section to that section should be three. One, two, three. Yep. And then. Oh, this is going to be tricky. I forgot how I did the pattern on this. Two, three, one, three, two. Okay. So this would be that first two. Let's see if this works. it does that is the pattern yep that's totally the pattern and then let's make sure this is right oh that's only two uh oh do i have to go that way one that would not make sense though oh no it is just two cool all right that makes things a little bit easier so it's three from this block but two from so it's three from the straight one, and then two, <laughs> two from the other one. Two, three. Maybe I will cut into that.
Oh, it goes outward. I was like, wait, that doesn't look right. And voila. I have a pattern. I guess I could just... We'll see what I do with that section. I'll just leave it like that. One, two, three, then the block. Wait. Hello, creeper. You gotta move, man. I love being in creative mode because then my creep the creepers don't completely destroy my builds. It's really nice. That's really cool. I like that. Let me just quickly memorize that pattern. <laughs> or I could do just a new set of patterns. Because then every circle thing would be different. That would be kind of interesting. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore what I had previously. Because I do not remember. Go like this. And then that flower design outwards. Hmm. Oop. Breaking too many blocks too fast. Okay. Flower shape. Followed by... Let's just do this one. Actually, let's do... Just a... Hmm. Ooh, and then I could do green. Oop, not the light block. Green flowery leaves with... The last two spruce. Ooh, the center of the flower could be green. There we go, that's cool. I like it. It's a bit different, but that's the point. Hmm. actually do the dark oak. Why don't I just do that over there? I do not know. That one's cool. Hmm. I wonder if I should do like a light, a light. That's cool. Hmm. Really? Oh, thank you. 
was like, I really don't want to have to pull out the sword, but I will if need be. Just kidding. Let's do... Perfect. That one's cool. And I don't think I'm using any of the same designs that I had previously, which is neat. Because I was worried I was going to. Really? Could you like hop out? It's really not that hard. Thank you. I appreciate the enthusiasm. Oh, it's hop hard to copy. What? Oh, wait. There we go. I was like, it's hard to copy what you had down. You don't remember what you had down. Voila! Three new designs! And then I think I have like grass here. Yeah, I do. I'll work on that later though. I kind of want to work with the rest of the design maybe? Because I have the outline. I guess what I could do. Okay, because I have. Hold on. Let my brain load for two seconds so I can formulate a normal sentence. The edge here is the out layer of where I want the next stuff to go. So I guess what I could do is this. And I'll actually like do the outline and see how it looks before I hide. You really had to stop right where I was working? Okay. Whatever. The longer I spend in here, the more mobs there are. So I have to go through and like kill them all before. It becomes too much of a nuisance. Is that a word? I feel like that's a word. May not be, but. Okay, I hate that. Alright, never mind. I feel like it's too... Maybe not, though. I took like two seconds to look at it. Let's look at it one more time. I don't know why, but I don't like it. I think it's too structured when I want it to be really, like, natural and... It was not in the slightest. Um, okay. Let's see. I guess I could do like two different leaves. So like I could do like a leaf over this direction and then like a middle, like bigger leaf kind of that follows this grass path, but not because I'd make it look different. I guess I could do that. Um, or I could do like... Hmm. Okay. I think I do have an idea for this one. So let's... I want to try it. I'm going to copy what that side is just on... Because as I go outward, if I just stick to the, uh, the path, maybe I can come up with something cool. That almost looks like a bigger version of those. That could be interesting to mess with. Let's see if I add a... Well, that might be interesting. Well, I guess I... The 
It really does look like a bigger version of what... Hold on. That would be there. Um, okay. Anyway. That's not what I want there? Yeah, I don't like that. Okay, it's too close to that to make it look... Okay. Next step. Next idea. Because that did not work. Not at all. Okay. I guess I could start off like... I just had an idea. I don't know how it'll look though. I was just gonna- okay. I was going to just do two flowers and then move on and do like stuff in between them, but I could do multiple flowers with similar designs throughout just like intermingling together. Ooh, that might be interesting. Huh. That might be really cool. But I have no idea. That's the issue. Okay, I think I'm gonna finish the grass section on this because either way I need to kind of get it finished. Because I won't feel like it's finished until I do that, so I need Okay, so it's two there's a lot of twos. I think it just follows along the edge of that way. It's really just this one that I needed. Huh, whoa. It's almost like I was already kind of doing that. I just can't remember if it overlays there or not. I don't think it does. It doesn't. I was right. Well, kind of. It kind of does. I think I vaguely remember there being like a dip and then it going over five. Like I vaguely remember the pattern that I used when building this, but... Honestly, it's been long enough that I don't. That looks right. Yeah. And then it just traces the outer edge because that looks cool. Oh wait, this one's different. Oh no, I about did it wrong. I did it right over here. I don't know why. I'm kind of, I think I did it. Maybe I did it wrong? Wait. Oh yeah, no, I definitely did it wrong. It's like that. Okay, there we go. That makes more sense i think so it goes into and then i think meets up with this part by doing that yeah that's how it is like i said lots and lots of twos to finish the patterns Oh. Forgot about that. We're just gonna ignore that. I have a lot to fill in here. Okay. 
I think the multiple flower idea is cool. I, I'm worried it's going to look too repetitive. Like there's going to be too many flowers. But I could be wrong and it look really neat. Um, hmm. That's my biggest worry, I feel like. Is it looking too repetitive? Because repetition is cool, like especially in this sections. But I'm worried if we do too many flowers, the pattern's gonna get boring and then it not it's not gonna be appealing when you look at it. I have some inspiration photos based off of like art that people have made and like people who do um, floral designs and things like that. So, just as a reference, I suppose. Oh, I just messed up the pattern because I went on autopilot. Oops. <laughs> Let me just fix that. There we go. There's the end of the pattern. I'm just gonna cover that. I'm also going to light up this just a little bit. I'll probably end up working on the lighting and making sure it fits the- whoa. Uh oh. What belongs there? Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Oh, it's just another. What? No, that does not go there. Wait, now I'm confused. Does that go like that? Yep, that's how it, it's done. Okay. Also just gonna grab that. Neat. I do think that looks good. Like this, this like florally pattern is honestly super pretty. I just don't know where to go from here. Cause I want these like dip in bits. Like even on this pattern, I have that lower level of grass and oh, this is another decision I have to make. Uh, there's the grass version and then there's the glass version so i like the glass version because in shaders the shaders that i'm using it kind of gives off like a reflective like surface which looks i think it looks really cool so like if it was glass it gives off a more pristine look and then it kind of reflects the walls and surface on the on the top layer of the glass which I think is a really cool vibe. Plus it gives like kind of a hazy look, which I really like. And then, but this is also really pretty because it reminds me of in this build over here, I've done like a, a water vibe. It's a garden. It's an indoor garden. Um, so it gives off the same vibe as like these section these section this section so it's like i can't tell what i want to do also i am gonna take that out because i don't like how it looks because i don't think it fits with the vibe so if for basically i'm doing this build as a series in a story basically whether I do it on my YouTube or my even my Twitch or the TikTok I have I have stuff up over there if you wanted to check that out um there's like it's basically based around a story where there's a basically I'll just a brief there's corruption and this is trying to emphasize that but I think it looks ugly and looks really weird and out of place 
So I think I'm just going to leave that for down here where I can do like a fog ravine. Anyway, that's a whole nother deal. Um, yeah, this feels really hazy. I wonder if they changed their... I need to change my settings. Anyway, so I think I'm going to do the glass, getting back on track, and then I'll figure out how I want to do the flowers. Maybe? I think for now, I really like how it's coming along. I really do. Um. I'm kind of stumped, honestly, when it comes to the next section of the build. Because on one hand, I want it to look... My original idea was to do giant... So on this side, you can see the remnants. Giant, like, swirls stemming from a point. But I didn't really like how that looked. Because it looked weird. <laughs> and so I was thinking about doing something different. And, well, I don't... I really do. I just barely came up with that, like, all floral idea. I really like that idea. I'll have to mess around and see. I'm gonna clean out this glass while I'm thinking about it. This glass? I meant grass. Hmm. I think a... Another idea I could possibly do is do more of just those loose points and do like smaller flowers all over the place so instead of like big flowers like that's those are the two main flowers and then have like smaller sets of flowers or things like those i don't even know what you would call that the like little more of the little section of things so, like I said, small flowers instead of, like, a lot of big flowers. Maybe that would take away the worry of doing too many big flowers and making it become repetitive. That might be a good way to not... Yeah, okay. My brain is, like, slowed down. All of a sudden. Weirdly enough. Um. Hmm. The small flowers might be interesting. I'll have to think about that. But for now, I really enjoy the progress we've made today. I think it's a lot of... I think... I just love building. I don't think I've said that, but, or if I have, I haven't said it enough. I really enjoy building, especially without the restraints that you have in like a survival world. Cause I play a lot of survival Minecraft as well, but in creative, it's really cool to just focus on the build instead of having to worry about getting all the supplies. Don't get me wrong. I love survival and I play it quite often. And there's a couple of, um, modded survival I play as well and I just really enjoy I enjoy both but I like that in creative I can focus more on little details like messing around if I want terracotta or concrete without having to get like a bajillion amount of each to really see how it looks because you can build a palette and then start building with it and it not be the right vibe of what you end up doing because originally originally i was using like this concrete right here and it just looked too bright compared to what the terracotta would have been so if that was in survival i would have had to go collect more supplies which i guess is the point but I really like creative building. 
And plus, if I wanted to, I could totally do this in survival, but it just takes so much time. Because this has already taken me, like, forever to get done and actually do. But I quite like it. Um, I think I might finish off taking this grass out and then call it for today's stream. Um, I'm planning on doing daily streams... So, if you want to be continuously updated on this build here, then I suggest you follow, and this is going to be fun, because we are nowhere near finished, because um, we have a lot... Oh. I just got stuck on a lantern. A lot of flooring to do. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm definitely going to call that for today. Because I have quite a few decisions I need to make about the floor. <laughs> That's such a weird concept. Anyway. That was fun! I enjoyed it! And I hope you enjoyed it too! Uh, have a good rest of your day. Bye!